government efforts to recognize and appreciate contributions of females towards the development of women in the country, the Partner Success Manager of Yango, Ghana, Sophia Silve, says that though the country has supported women to excel in many fields, more is still needed. Accra has a population of around 4 million inhabitants, yet professional female drivers amount to just a decimal percent of all the drivers on the road. Gender equality has been a topic of discussion around the world and it is no different in driving. Based on statistics from the World Bank, women's labor force participation fell to 49% in 2016, with the women more likely to work in the informal sector and spend at least twice as much time as men on unpaid domestic work and care activities. For these gender disparities, Ghana is no different when it comes to driving. There is no law in the West African country banning women from driving, however, more men are seen on the Ghanaian roads than women. Despite the increase in women drivers for private vehicles, finding commercial women drivers on Ghanaian roads is a different narrative. It is against this backdrop that a program has been organized to encourage women in driving. Sophia Sylvie is the Partner Success Manager of Yango Ghana. A woman is important to me because I believe that uh, we can do it. I'm an advocate for women can do it too. So I'm reaching out to all women. Today we had a very uh, wonderful experience. We uplift each other. We spoke about experiences. We spoke about our stories. We shared our success stories together. And then uh, we are using this opportunity as a stepping stone to bring all women on board who create a women uh, community where we would encourage each other and bring more women to drive on Yango. Media personality Anita Ekufu charged females to take advantage of every opportunity to excel. We've done quite well, but I think there's more we can do when it comes to um, getting women uh, either to be in politics, to hold powerful positions, I, I mean, all spheres of life. And so there's more we can do as a country. And this is also um, one of the steps that we are taking, especially when it comes to um, companies like these getting women on board. And so um, I believe there's more we can do. Women are capable. Let's give them the chance. Let's open the doors. Let's make it very, very easy as well for more women to, you know, shatter the glass ceilings and everything that has to do with them excelling. Uh, women should rise up or women should do whatever they want to do. Uh, once it gives you joy, once you're passionate about it, you don't let anybody talk you down. Go all out. Do it the best possible way you want to do it. And trust me, you will excel at it. A female driver also spoke to the news team. Uh, naturally, I love to drive. I love driving. I can drive the whole day without getting tired. So I decided that, you know, I should make some money out of something that I love and I enjoy doing. That's made me start. Uh, I started in 2017. 